my equestrian friends, it's me Lisa, the Budget Equestrian. Welcome back to another video. And today I wanted to share kind of a fun video with you. We're back in my tack room. I love being in my tack room. And actually during the summer I spend a lot of time in my tack room. My tack room is pretty much organized and it works for me of getting my saddles, getting my bridles, and having easy access to everything so I can get out there and work with both of my horses. But one thing that I've been noticing lately, my saddle pads are taking up a lot of excess space. So today I wanna to show you a simple way to make more use of this space for different things and how you can keep your saddle pads on one rack. That's what we're gonna do right now. Wasn't that easy? And I was able to get most of my saddle pads all on one blanket bar, which before I have three blanket bars and I had the other saddle pads sitting underneath my saddle. So I was able to get all my saddle pads in one spot and really utilize this blanket bar to the best of my ability. It's pretty neat, isn't it? Pretty easy and I just feel so proud of myself for figuring this out. I just had to share it with you. And if you wanna do something like this in your own tack room, I can't remember where I got the blanket bar. I know Jeffers has them and Dover Saddlery and I'm sure Riding Warehouse does too. The blanket bar was probably around $15. And then these hangers, these are skirt hangers. I got them on Amazon and they were $14.99 for 10 of them and that is being shipped out prime shipping. I think I got them, I ordered them on Friday and I got them on a Saturday. So they came really, really fast. And the hangers themselves, if you're wondering if they're gonna tear apart my saddle pads, they won't. Inside the little clips, they have a nice plastic piece to protect anything that you're gonna hang up on them. And they come in different colors. I thought white, should have probably gotten black, but that's okay. 
and they have a little bit of adjustment play so you can kind of adjust it how you want it to go like that and then you just hang it up it can go kind of at an angle or it can go straight depending on how much space you have where you put your blanket bar i have no idea how tall this is from the floor tall enough that the saddle pads aren't touching the floor which is kind of perfect and i don't know if i'm going to keep my half pads up here i'll probably move these to the blanket bar that's on top but if i wanted to make the most of the space this is perfect and it works really great hopefully that gave you some ideas of what you can do in your own tack room Thank you so much for taking time out of your day to watch this video. Be sure to subscribe to my channel so you can watch all my other DIY and horse product review videos showing you how to make the most of the time that you have with your horse. Again, thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.